In terms of the uh, factors that affect outcome, there's injury severity, um, and usually that means if your child was injured and you have a what's called a Glasgow Coma Scale, which is a measure of how deeply comatose you are, um, with a Glasgow Coma Scale of eight or less. Um, you can't get any lower than three, by the way, in the Glasgow Coma Scale, because then you're dead. Um, so a Glasgow Coma Scale of three, you're pretty deeply in a coma. And children and adults with Glasgow Coma Scales of three and stay at a very low level for a long period of time tend not to do as well because it's an indication that they have had more brain damage and more areas of the brain are, are injured. Other factors include um, other comorbid uh, medical problems that can occur like depression, seizures, um, hormonal uh, problems. Then one of the key factors is how well is the family and friends being able to interact and support that person, uh, how well is the community adapting and supporting the person, and then how well can the person with the brain injury um, end up feeling good about themselves and happy that they're doing something that is meaningful to them, meaningful to society, and feeling that they're loved and that they have someone to love them. I think when you have that, you tend to be successful.